What is going on, everyone? My subscribers, my email list, my YouTube subscribers, whichever you may be watching this video, I want to say what's going on. I know you all have not heard from me for a very long time. Normally, it's not an email. If you're on my email list, I normally it's not an email like every freaking day, just up Saturdays and Sundays. But I actually been dealing with a, a little life crisis, family crisis, you could say. So I, I kind of the great thing about this industry is that when life throws you a curveball, you still can produce income without working. That's one reason why I love being an internet marketer because as this little curveball like hit me across the head, like psh, hit me across the head, income was still being able to produce. And I want to shoot this quick video because my children's actually had a birthday party. And I just wanted to come and shoot this quick training video because my whole assignment, why you're on my email list, is to be able to help you take your business to the next level, period. You are here because you want to know how can you take your business to the next level. You're not here because like, I write good emails. You're not here because I make good YouTube videos. You're not here because none of that. You're here or you're watching this video. You're on my email list because you want to know how exactly can you take your business to the next level. So, um, what about to say? Um, this upcoming Monday, I plan to get back on my regular routine habits of writing emails every single day, Monday through Friday. So be on the lookout for my upcoming emails. I even plan to do some webinars and also, also, I got a conference call coming up. Conference call coming up that, that we're doing the finishing touches on it. So every Sunday, probably about 8 p.m. to 8.45, 8, 8, 8 o'clock p.m. to 8.45 p.m., a little mindset conference call that I'm going to start doing. I'm just going to start giving value to you all that can help you take your business to the next level because we're in June now. We're in June, so we have to, you have to start producing the results because we, we all... And in fact, we all set these goals in January. We set we set goals, and our goals be something like we want to be all high up here. But normally, how it goes is January come, and we we start out we start out high. So we start out high, and then February come, we take a little dip, and then March come, we take a little dip. And sometimes we we may pick back up in April, but it's like right when June gets here, or or going into the summer seasons. We, I'm not talking about business, I'm talking about we as individuals. We kind, we kind of like go down. I don't know what it is, I don't know because the children are out of school. I don't know what it is, but a lot of businesses, home-based business entrepreneurs, by the time the summertime here, it's like, if you're having a good month of May, June somewhat goes down like this, and then August may pick up and then go like this, and then like this, kind of like a, a wave. And so my whole goal is, if your business is down, I want to be able to pick it up and then on from there, we're just going straight to the top. That's it. We're, we're, it's not a way. It's not a way. We're just going straight to the top. That is that is my goal. So that's why I'm about to start having webinars, conference calls, sending out emails. I may be emailing you twice a day, Monday, but twice a day, if not three times a day. So I know the real subscribers who will love to hear that will stay on. People who's not really feeling me, they're going to hit the unsubscribe button. Totally fine. I get it. But my main objective is to really help you take your business to the next level. So let's get on to the training. Here we go. Here we go. The mindset of a winner. The mindset of a winner. Because if you're going to succeed, my friend, if you're going to succeed, you have to develop the mindset of a winner. Losers do not win in business, period. Losers don't win. If you're going to win, my friend, you have to develop the mindset of a winner, of a champion, my friend, period. Period. Matter of fact, I'll give you a good example. Right now, the Cavaliers are down. They're down 3-1 to one in the playoff series. Well, when it was down 3-0, LeBron James could have said, you know what, we're just going to give it a towel. We're going to let them, we're not even going to play the next game. But they go for Golden State, go ahead and win a championship. No, they got the mindset of a winner. So they came out yesterday, whenever you're watching this video, they came out yesterday and they, they really just destroyed Golden State to make it a 3-1 series, my friend. So in business, it's like if we purchase a product, if we purchase a product, and let's say that product is kind of, um, kind of geared, kind of, uh, 
what, what's what I'm looking for? Uh, let's say that product is moving us to purchase another product that will help us along our way. A lot of times we'll shut the door and then we'll write an email and say, hey, I want a refund because it required me to invest or inquire me to do this, inquire me. That's not the mindset of a winner. A mindset of a winner says this, if I buy a product and I see something that's offering me something that can better help me, I'm going to do whatever is possible, whatever is possible to get the funds, whatever I have to do to make it happen. So many individuals, they too, they so quick to give up on their dreams. Now, I don't understand that. I don't understand it. And you can hear the passion in my voice because so many individuals, if something don't go right the first time, bam, I'm giving up. I, I quit. I give up. I quit. And you're going to win, my friend. If you're going to win, you have to develop the mindset of a winner. One of the key traits of a mindset of a winner is quitting is not an option. Quitting is not an option. Quitting is not an option. There is no option. It's not. If you're going to win, my friend, in business, you have to understand quitting is not an option, my friend. It's not. I have invested. I probably invested over, I don't know, I think probably over $75,000, if not more, on books, <laughs> books, CDs, traveling to events, actually, actually, where, where is that? Actually, I was supposed to go to Boston. I mean, let me, I don't know if you can see this. Oh, yeah, I was supposed to go to Boston um, Thursday, this past Thursday, for a marketing event. But because of the life crisis that I'm kind of, I'm, I'm not saying I'm dealing with, I'm kind of over it. I was not able to make it to Boston because I wanted to be here. But this is $300 that's just been wasted. <laughs> Not to mention the hotel that I had to pay for and etc. This right here by itself is this three hundred dollars went, went went the drain. I, I didn't use it. I didn't. I didn't. I didn't find a boss. And I stayed here in Charlotte. So what? What am I supposed to do? Oh man, it didn't work. So I'm gonna. I, I, I couldn't go. So I'm gonna give up and and quit. No, my friend. No. The, the mindset of a winner is the next event. I will make it there. That's it. This, this this time it didn't go as well for me. Next time I'm gonna make it there. Point blank, simple. Another another trait, and I'm gonna, I'm gonna let you go. This another trait of developing the mindset of a winner, my friend, is you have to increase your value. Period. In business, see a lot of y'all watching this video may be in the MLM network marketing niche. And a lot of, one of the common denominators I see in that niche is a lot of people will pay money to join a business, but, but are not willing to invest to learn how to build the business. <laughs> I don't understand that. It's like, we'll pay $500 to join the business, but we're not willing to invest whatever is possible to learn how to build the business. And if you're going to succeed, my friend, you have to increase your value. Like I just said, I said I done spent over $75,000 on books, CDs, courses, hiring coaches. I mean, you name it, I done it. <laughs> so I don't do that to brag, but it lets you know the mindset of a winner. And I'm not asking you to do that, but it, it depends how bad do you want it. See, one of the reasons why I invest so much money into my education to me delivering value to the marketplace is because, number one, like I said in the beginning of this video, I'm able to not come on the internet, not come on the computer, and still check my account and money still being deposited into my account whether I show up or not. That's one of the reasons why I invest so much money into my value, me being able to get value, me buying books. Oh, let me see. Me, well, this is my dad's me buying books. Books, books, books. <laughs> I mean, this, this, that, that's the reason why, because that's one of the reasons. Number two is I enjoy spending time with my family. I enjoy, I enjoy waking up, waking my daughter up and she said, Hey daddy, can we go to breakfast? And we can ride down to IHOP, Waffle House somewhere. And, and I'm not, I'm not 
bogged down by a job or anything like that. I, this is one of the reasons why I invest so much because I enjoy things like that. Number three, I enjoy wearing a tank top. I'm actually working, making this video with a tank top on. I I, I don't like wearing, wearing hot clothes in a warehouse. So I say all that to say is, I say all that to say this. How bad do you want it? How bad do you want it? How bad do you want it, my friend? If you want it bad enough, the, it doesn't matter. It, the money won't be a factor. You will find a way to get it done. The excuses, it leave. No more excuses. Forget excuses. We don't tolerate excuses. We just get it done, my friend. It does not matter. You have to develop the mindset that you will do anything humanly possible to succeed because your why, your why is just that big of a factor to you, my friend. That's it. And I, I'm leaving with that. I'm leaving with that. Uh, friends, Ty Neal here. I'm actually about to head to the gun range, go let some rounds up. I enjoy shooting in case you don't know that about me. Um, but before I let you go, add me on Snapchat. Add me on Snapchat. My username is Ty Neil Marketing. Add me on Snapchat. So be on the lookout my be on the lookout for my email on Monday. Friends, Ty Neil. I hope you got something out of this train. I hope it was a value. Just remember, just remember, mindset of a winner. In business, things don't come to you as easy. If that was the case, everybody would be an entrepreneur. You have to you have to literally look in your heart and ask yourself, how bad do I want it? How bad do I want it? How bad do I want to not have a boss? How bad do I want to wear, I don't know, a tank top? How bad do I want to be able to not come to work and still make money? How bad do I want that? And if you want it bad enough, my friend, you will do whatever is humanly possible to make it happen. Friends, Ty Neal here, signing out. Talk soon. Enjoy your day.